becomes cloudy, making things look blur. Most cataracts develop slowly before interfering with one's vision. According to the 2015 Ghana Blindness Survey report, cataract was responsible for more than half, that is 54.8% of blindness in Ghana, with the northern regions recording the highest cases. Interacting with journalists in Tamale after a free cataract surgery for over 1,000 patients, head of eye unit of the Tamale Teaching Hospital, Dr. Gilbert Batiaka, expressed concerns over the prevalence of cataract cases in the northern regions. The highest burden of blindness is actually in the northern part of the country. Northern region has a, high, a very high burden of blindness. Now, we set out to screen and do surgery for 800 patients. We were able to screen over 6,000 patients. Out of this, we got over 1,400 patients eligible for cataract surgery. What we have seen during the outreach, we realized that lots of people are blind, but they remain at home. We don't know why they are not coming to hospital. Either they think that their blindness cannot be cured, or they do not know that there is treatment for their blindness. Country Director of Daybreak Vision Project and Ophthalmologist Dr. Akwesi Ahmed appealed to Ghanaians to take interest in caring for their eyes. The message I have for everyone listening is that the eyes are the window to the soul. So when you don't have your vision, you basically, your body is cut off from the rest of the world, okay? And so um, we should take our eyes seriously. Everyone should try and get an eye checkup at least once a year. Cataract is, is treatable. Some of the beneficiaries of the free eye surgery could not hide their excitement. Grateful to realize the first promise in the Bible. The blind shall see, the lame shall walk. Happy to realize it in my life.